Hey, friends from all over the world. This is uh, Scott Schmidt here. I just had a, I just had a word for you today. Um, real quick, I was uh, at a men's ministry um, this week on Monday, and uh, we were talking about different things about having friends and um, you know different kind of influences in our life and what do you think is a good friend and you know all that kind of stuff. But um, so anyway, I was at work and um, there was a guy that was. Uh, from from this other company that um, you know we sourced out that's changing the fluorescent lights on the on the on the roof of the building underneath you know ceiling and he's on a crane and he uh, and so I was just sitting there and I was praising the Lord and uh, and all of a sudden you know I was singing and all of a sudden he he was passing me on to, over top of my head and he was had his radio on and he's pl and I could hear that old Gin Blossom song playing, uh, Anywhere You Go, I'll Follow You, you know? So then I was like, Lord, why, why would, is this a coincidence? What, what am I supposed to glean from this, from the song, or, or, or does it mean anything? So anyway, all of a sudden, it just, it just hit me, just like that, like lightning, that, you know, when, like what we were talking about at our, at our men's, at our men's meeting, that, you know, you, you can have friends in your life, and you get to a point where, are they influencing you, or are you influencing them? Does that make sense? Because that's what happens sometimes. We get involved with people, and we try to help them, and different things like that. But after a while, it can it can turn out that they're they're sucking you in, you know. So anyway, the song was going through my head, and, and I was trying to listen to the words and and, under, and understand what I was trying to uh, get from it, and and the words. The, uh, the, the course of the song is this, and this is when it hit me. It says, anywhere you go, I'll follow you down. Anywhere that I don't know by heart. Anywhere you go, I'll follow you down. I'll follow you down, but watch this now. I'll follow you down, but not that far. Amen? Not that far. In other words... I can only go so far with you, you know? I can only go so far with you. And when it comes to the part where now my, you know, my walk is being, or you, if you're being a stumbling block to my walk, and I want to start being influenced by you, thinking what you think rather than thinking what I think, you know? More getting more of that world in me than the world out of them. You know, which is our our job as as, as believers. So then I saw the uh, the bridge of the song, and the bridge goes like this. It says, "It says how how are you gonna find your place, running that artificial pace, or running that artificial pace? Are they gonna find us lying face down in the sand? Well, what does lying face down in the sand?" That means, and he says, us, right? So now, he's influenced by them. Anywhere you go, I'll follow you. And he, lends, and he ends up lying face down in the sand. And then it says, so what the hell now? We've already been forever damned. You know what I mean? I was like, whoa. So next time you hear that song, you know, flipping through your radio and you hear that song, we've already been forever damned, you know? So, you know, again, this is just a quick word just to say, you know, you know, you have to watch yourself and you're, you have to keep, you know, like they say, you know, we, we should be, you know, of the world, you know, not of the world, not of the world, amen, and we could be in the world, but not of the world, you know, and like, like they say, how are you supposed to save people if you're not of the world, but you have to be very, very careful that that you are influencing them and they aren't influencing you. Amen. So I hope that you're uh, blessed by this and you get something from it. In the mighty name of Yeshua HaMashiach, Jesus Christ of Nazareth, be blessed. Amen.